Hello, I'm Anna Tao. I'm the brand design lead at Chipotle. You may have heard of it. I, you have heard of it. I was going to tell you it was a burrito joint, you know, gaining popularity, but, but you've heard of it. So what's a brand design lead? Essentially, I direct Chipotle's look and feel at every level of engagement, whether that's uh, creating it in-house or art directing a vendor to do it. So that's everything. That's the outside of the restaurant, the inside of the restaurant, what we're putting out in the market in advertising, and then all our channels, digital channels, social channels. Um, I think the biggest thing and probably the funniest thing I've learned doing this job for the last four years is that people will do anything for a free burrito. <laughs> They will wait in line for two hours. They will write haiku poetry. They will write book reports. They will play any game we put out there on the internet. And they will give us their cell phone number just to get these free burritos. So you may have noticed that there is free Chipotle in your tote bags. If you ask me, I think you guys are getting off a bit easy. You just have to listen to me talk for five minutes. Um, but. In all honesty, I've learned a few more things um, doing this job. And I'm going to be speaking this Saturday. And I'm specifically going to be talking about making the leap from working in a design agency to working in-house. And maybe even more specifically, I'm going to talk about all the hesitations I had in, in taking this job. And let me tell you, there were many. Um, moving from San Francisco to New York, creating a team from scratch, but I kept coming back to these rumors about in-house. You know, I thought it was gonna be boring, stifling to work on just one brand. I was gonna slap a burrito on the layout, call it good, done. Um, you know, I thought design agencies, you know, they get to work on the sexier projects. That's what we hear, right? They're gonna bring in the big guns to solve the important problems, and then I was going to get stuck doing all the internal department projects. And then this is a rumor I think maybe we've all heard, um, that in-house designers are not as talented. When they can't cut it at the agency, they move in-house. And then, you know, this one was maybe me being hopeful, but I thought, <laughs> I, thought I was going to leave my chaotic agency life behind, and I was going to have a bright, you know, work-life balance out there. So to answer that first question, whether I was just going to slap a burrito on, on every layout, I brought some burritos to share with you. And you can see burritos are very celebratory in many, many ways. Burritos are romantic. <laughs> burritos have a lot of heart. And you know what? You can make a burrito shape out of almost anything. I brought a vintage one. Usually when you roll something this good, it's illegal. <laughs> there, <laughs> there are endless burrito jokes out there. Burritos show up on Easter. You can put them in a basket. Or this other basket. Burritos have pride. <laughs> Nurses appreciate burritos. So do teachers. And burritos are essential for back to school. They'll be with you when you graduate. <laughs> <laughs> this is Jacko Burrito for Halloween. And this guy, he tells, he tells you that Chipotle is not open on Thanksgiving. No turkey burritos. And this is where it gets good. Burritos go all out for the holidays. They're super, super festive. These two are probably going to kiss. <laughs> yeah, it's still, still going. And of course, in the, in the snow globe. And then another vintage one, um, letting you know burritos are so big, you may want to ride them. And then we made it so. <laughs> yeah. So the answers. Which one of these are true? 
You know, some of them are true. You know, shucks, working in-house is tough sometimes. And yes, I work for one brand, but you know, as you can see, it's anything but boring. And as you can probably guess, it's not just about slapping a burrito and a layout. Our, our work goes much, much deeper than that. But if you ask me, I think any layout is, is better with a burrito on it. Um, so I'll be speaking this Saturday. I'm going to talk more about these, which are true, which are not true. And, and more specifically, I think what I've learned about building you know, a vibrant in-house creative team, finding and you know, creating your own wins, and staying just truly, truly inspired despite some of these rumors being true. And I hope you can all join me. Mm -hmm.